Hello everyone, my name is JD Valenzuela from BS Ed Major in English 1B, your future educator. And I am here to discuss communication flow and process. Let us know first, what is communication process? Communication process is the goal of communication is to transmit information and the understanding information from one person or group to another person or group. When we say communication process, it is a series of action or steps taken in order to successfully communicate to other. Let us know first the basic elements of communication. First, the sender or the speaker. The sender first develops an idea which is composed into a message and then transmitted to the other party who interprets the message and receives meaning. And also, the sender or the speaker is the individual or group of people who initiate the communication. The second one is the encoding or messages, the process of converting ideas into understandable message. It is also the process of turning thoughts into communication. The next one is the transmission or signal, a one-way linear process in which a sender encodes a message and transmits it through a channel to a receiver who decodes it. The next is recipient or decodes. The person or groups of person who receives the message sent by the sender, the process of interpreting the message. Next is receiver. The one that received the message or information by the sender or speaker. Next is the feedback. The response of the receiver to the message of the sender. Next is the noise or barrier. The factor that blocks the flow of conversation. Example for this is other talking in the background, background music, a startling noise, and acknowledging someone outside of the conversation. Lastly, context or setting. An additional that helps the receiver to understand more the message. Now that we all know the communication flow, let us now focus on how does communication process work. Communication process begins in sender or speaker. The sender will encode the ideas into understandable message and once the ideas converted in it will turn into message, the message transmitted into the receiver through the use of transmission or signal and the receiver decode it and give it their feedback to the sender and that's how communication process works. That's all. Thank you and God bless.